put your key in the ignition and turn the car to on, but do not start it. This is your driver information center in the dash here. You're gonna wanna clear all the warnings from that. Do that by simply pressing reset until they're gone. Next, we need to clear out the driver's information center altogether. You do that by pressing options until the screen is blank. We're gonna enter training mode. You simply hold down the reset button for around three seconds until training mode comes up. So you can see we've got fob training. You can use that to train new key fobs, but we wanna train new tire pressure sensors so I'm gonna press options button four until we get tire training. Then press reset to enter tire training mode. What it's done is it's, it's gone to the first tire to be trained. That's the, the front left tire. And a couple things to note, if you turn the ignition off, it will remember which tire pressure sensors you've programmed up to that point. Otherwise, if you wait longer than two minutes, it will exit tire learning mode and it will again remember which tire pressure sensors you've programmed up until that point. You're gonna find a strong magnet. I just picked this up at a hobby store. You can use a speaker magnet or a pot magnet. They will work very well. You may if it's not strong enough, you may need to stack a few magnets together as I have here. And what you're going to do is you're just going to take that magnet and you're going to place it at the end by the valve stem. 